Only on News 5, how much are 500 feet of Lake Erie shoreline worth? One city is willing to throw a six-figure sum at protecting this stretch of beach. Menor is ponying up $380,000 to try and put a stop to erosion at a lakefront park. Yeah, it's a battle that a lot of communities in Northeast Ohio are trying to fight. And News 5's Jordan Vandenberg live from Minter Beach Park tonight. And Jordan, go ahead and tell us what this project actually looks like. Well, it is very wet work and there's a whole lot of digging involved. Crews spent the day today, the first couple days of this construction project, digging out some of the old erosion control measures, including a large culvert, a whole lot of driftwood and some old, rather large stones. We're making way for some new technology here at Menor Beach Park. And this is a problem. This is a solution that we're going to be seeing more and more of as the erosion issues show no sign of slowing down. With her trusty Nikon, Heather Barninger. I just came to snap a couple of photos looking for birds. <laughs> captures moments in time because the landscape of Menor Beach Park is always changing. It's right here. I mean, it's nice to be so close to the lake and you get to see all the different wildlife. On this day, wildlife had to coexist. It's part of the city's effort to stabilize 500 feet of the valuable lakefront park especially near the pavilion, which officials hope can be redeveloped. The emergency project, officials hope, it's a never ending battle, will prevent further erosion. Erosion's a known problem for ever on Lake Erie, and this has been let go for so long. Uh, now we got a major problem here. I like the part of like, you know, keeping it from the erosion. Um, that's obviously an issue here and at a couple other places parks close to here. That's why the state created its expedited permitting process for shoreline stabilization efforts. Since the process was created in May, records show the state has issued 30 permits across four counties. At Menor Beach Park, historical photos show erosion has already erased large tracts of land. And if not for projects like these, the photos that Barninger is taking could show how much more land will be lost. Oh, it's important because then there's not going to be any beach left. There's not going to be, it's just going to fade right away. So you have to, you have to take precautions to keep from the erosion, to keep from the beaches eroding anymore. City officials say they have received some interest in possibly turning the pavilion into a restaurant. However, nothing is set in stone. And city officials also tell me that the stabilization project should be wrapped up by February. Reporting live at Menor Beach Park, Jordan Vandenberg, News 5.